happening? Okay, I think we're on. And we're live. Okay, so I'm Tori Mahara. I'm Maria Pokemon Show. And today we are reacting, reviewing, whatever you want to call it, to Sky Dancers Episode 4. So let's enjoy and see what a uh, high trip we get today. I think it's reacting. Alright, we'll go with reacting then. Oh, lordy. <laughs> I'm sorry, I just noticed how weird Breeze's little thing is. Yeah, it is strange. It's like, he takes pride in his native uh, roots, which is okay, that's cool. If that but, wasn't so freaking generic. Yeah, if it wasn't generic, and it, it just, it did, it doesn't look right. I'm sorry, it doesn't, but we do give Skydance's credit for giving the native the cool power instead of heart. You do realize... <laughs> It's, I know. Uh, his power is also generic Native American. I guess. Thing. I guess, but it's Elemental Master Spark versus Heart. Which one do you rather have? The Master Spark. <laughs> See, everybody agrees the Master Spark is better. I will smack somebody. <laughs> Getting the story. Okay. Next. <laughs> Are you proud, Mr. Olex Scar, and whatever the other name is, for writing this thing? They get money, that's all they care. Mm -hmm. Nice pun there, bro. Hey, that's not a bad idea. I see the Why is there always going to be a girl reporter type or stuff like this? Because of Lois Lane. One determined high school newspaper reporter. That, that is my explanation. Because you of Lois Lane. You guys are in high school? Uh, she was. I don't think they are. I think they're in college. See, uh, so since they're in the academy, it sounds like they're in a special college. Okay. We don't know, uh... Well, why would a high school student try to be... What? Interviewing college students. That sounds kind of weird. Well, it might be a project, or it might be, like... Or maybe she's just crazy for a story. Either that or possibly Yandere for one of the male sky dancers. There's only what two. What is Yandere? Yandere means you're so obsessed with a male and or female, there are male Yandere's, that you will kill anyone else that even tries to get close to them. Oh, great. That is what it means. I ask you to give a warm welcome to our alumnus and good friend, Breeze Running Bear. Really? Yes. Really? That, that's your last fucking name? I, yes. I, I am going to get somebody. <laughs> yes, they came up with a very bad generic name for a Native American. And now we see that high school girl is developing crush on college boy that's way out of her league. Because Breeze is the only cool dude. Camille's the only cool girl. I think I recognize <laughs> this one from when I was little. Maybe. And you jumped really, really far. Maybe he, again, he has powers over wind, uh, so maybe we can do Superman that's sort of thing. It's only in the window. I guess. She's obviously got the hots for him. <laughs> oh, I got the hots for this one here. Oh, come on, I'm not so hot. It's. Yes, you are. You're the only good one, Loki one. And we have uh, what? skipping. What was that? And now the audio is gone. I think I'll be safe. This is a 1996 cartoon thing that we're seeing on the internet, so we don't know. I give up. 
<laughs> oh like, my lord. Yep. <laughs> yep. That's a that's a y'all dairy look right there. That's a he's all mine. That was definitely y'all dairy. That was creepy. Yep. That was just like <laughs> Yep, yep, that that screams y'all dairy. Really? Mm -hmm. So, it's most helpless, and you know this, and you don't give them extra, you don't find a way to get them extra protection? <laughs> Sky dancers. <laughs> so we're gonna say that. Sky dancers. Oh, I just also noticed recently... Whoever is world, whoever is twirl, I really don't care. The one that has green hair has green eyes, the one that has red has red eyes. Oh, that's freaky. Yeah. Come on, big guy. Knock over the bottles with one throw and you win a big prize. No sweat. Uh, that was creepy as sin right there. <laughs> Teleportation! Yep. <laughs> yep. <laughs> she has. She's still freaking me out. Yep. Yeah, day. We need to play Q or something right now, or maybe you know, uh, normal people would not know what that is. I know. How about we keep the Utiloid references to yeah, a minimum? minimum. <laughs> it's like, um, girl, I do not. I'm not into you. <laughs> Oh, I, I definitely remember this one when I was little. My, my, isn't this cozy? Who is that girl? And what is she doing here? Why don't you ask Breeze? Excuse me, would someone mind telling me what's going on? Yeah, you're the size of a fairy right now. Hmm. All this later. We must leave for Sky Hive immediately. Sky Clone has already begun his attack. Oh, so there's different places besides that generic castle place that mm. they always go to. Yay! Alternate areas! Expansion on universe! Congratulations, show of... <laughs> Highness? <laughs> I suppose is all we can call it. Are you afraid of heights? You better get used to it. And apparently the most helpless area is one that the looks to the sky ha ha that looks like bees. Yeah. Well, they live oh. in the hives. Yeah. I mean bees are pretty fragile, but they're also pretty resilient too. I mean they are insects. So if nothing else they have numbers on their side. Why aren't you doing something? Do something! That's all I'm asking! Someone do something! I don't care what it is! Just someone do something! Ooh, can I have one? Hmm? And also bee boobs! I don't know if you just saw that right there, but there were bee boobs. <laughs> Whenever someone says demonstration and it's a bad guy, it's usually something very bad. But you can levitate! Oh, logic. Logic of the show. Um, yeah, I don't really see how that's... Apparently she was able to get away. They don't even have legs. They have a tail, though. With no legs. It's the thing. This is great. I'm gonna be the world's youngest war correspondent. No offense, Ace. The name is Caroline. Mm. Caroline. But you don't have wings. You'd only slow us down. The safest thing is for you to stay here. Uh -huh. <laughs> You're just trying to keep me away from Breeze so he blows me off. 
Yep, Yandere. I'm trying to make sure you don't get blasted to pieces by Sky Clone's horror canes. I don't know who Sky Clone is, and I don't know what a horror cane is, but I do know I'm not gonna stay here and miss all the action. Let's swing it, Breeze. Don't worry, Ace. We'll give you yep, the they're shipped together. You already saw the kiss from last episode. They're shipped. Go! Ship, 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 ship. Officially shipped. I'm going to take care of there, there's no car. getting away from it. They're shipped and Jade and uh, Slam are. I'm 90% certain are shipped. And Camille gets someone from somewhere. Hmm. Skyla's not happy. Skyla's pissed. <laughs> She's gonna do something. She'll probably pull a Celestia. It's like whatever Celestia would do, that's probably what Skyla's gonna do. But you can levitate. It's almost you know, the same as you know, the thing. You know. No. Skylanders. I dancers. I dancers. Why? <laughs> you sprayed them with goo? That's what you did? That's kind of lame. Yeah, it might be insecticide. <laughs> That's all I've got. It's insecticide. Therefore, it's effective. I wonder if Barbara Walters had to start like this. Who the hell is Barbara Walters? Really? Really? Yeah, really! God darn it, Toto! <laughs> You're stupid! Wait, wait, wait! I'm Mr. Master's Mark! Yes! Oh, I got the Master's Mark! That okay, be after happy. this, Toto is going to look up Barbara Walters. There is no way she is getting around that. She is going to look up Barbara Walters, and there is nothing she can do about it. See, Jake's car is useful. It's Barbara just Walters is one of the most well-known news reporters ever. Oh, well that would be why I don't know her. I don't really watch the news. I'm gonna slap her now. <laughs> it's just because the news is so depressing. I'd rather hate on Sky Dancers for being the high kid show that it is. Because I'm, I'm very glad that there's been an increased quality in kids shows these days. Because if this is an indication of where kids shows would have been going in the past, oh, I don't know, ten years, then kids show animation might have been dead by now. I, I don't, I, good kids show animation. Yeah. This is, we just made this to sell toys. Uh, G3 is worse. Yeah, that's true. But this is, again, this is only slightly better. Slightly. By a quark size. That's not much. Who's a good boy? Who's a good boy? Yeah. MPS is loving on my dog again. <laughs> hey, I miss my dog at home. It's okay. You can love on my little moochie as much as you need to. Where's your fashion sense? What's wrong? Apparently she doesn't like the blue people. I never like the blue people. Yep, Lois Lane. Apparently they find that funny. He's like, shit. <laughs> Yes! More about some spark! <laughs> they, they probably don't know what an interview is. Mm. Just considering. Mm. I guess. Destroy the sky dancers! I mean, it might be Slam and Camille that are shipped, but I'm. Again, I'm 90% certain it's Jade and Slam. You know, I'm not really sure the girl's 
personality wise. Yeah. I, I think Camille gets her ship later uh, in the season. The thing is, the big one that I know personality wise is Slam because he's such a fucking dumbass. Yep. Yep. That's pretty much his personality. He is, he's Ryan to the extreme. Mm hmm. Ryan, if Ryan never said anything intelligent. Intelligent. Which Ryan sometimes does, so yeah. it's all, it's okay. It is okay. Because we love Ryan. Ryan is awesome. Slam, no. You will never match up to the awesomeness of Ryan. <laughs> Ever. So basically you made a fortress and out of the code thing. And now they're stuck in there. How are they going to get food? How are they going to get supplies? Yandere syndrome. You just want to hide from them. <laughs> that is very much Yandere syndrome. You don't need a nose job, lady. You look fine. Yeah, you were stupid. You should have stayed inside the fort. Your oh, sky clone? Great! There's like a couple thousand questions I'd like to ask you. No, if you don't no, mind. Wait, What's your beef wait, with Skylar Window? Me. Do you uh, think you have a uh, chance go, against the uh, Sky Dancers? Uh, make haste! Go find Queen Skylar! Tell her I've captured the infernal female and her infernal mouth! I will trade her for the Sky Swirl Stone! Now go! Mm, I think you can keep her. No. Take it easy. We're just messengers. I don't know what other choice we have except to give Sky Clone the Sky Swirl Stone. Really? Don't. Really? Um, you could just let her die. I mean, if she was useful. I could see where you're going, but... But she's just a uh, Princess Peach that's not in the RPGs or Smash Bros. Because in the RPGs and Smash Bros, Princess Peach is awesome. But otherwise, no. She just exists to be kidnapped. And in RPGs, she's funny. Yes. Although, her most funniness is, um... Is in Thousand Year Door and, um... Super Paper Mario. You're mm. driving me out of my mind. Yep. And I don't know anything about Superstar. Mm. Other than no, she just gets kidnapped. She doesn't get oh, to really? do anything. She doesn't do anything. She doesn't do anything. Fucking a! I know. It sucks. Peach. I know. She's usually good at the Paper Mario series. Of the all-powerful Sky Clone, tremble before my mighty power. I stopped trembling the day I discovered that Godzilla was a man in a rubber suit. And what's with the shouting? You know, they say shouting is overcompensating for your own insecurity. Now, I'm on an angle on this tangle with the Sky Dancers. Enough! And you're a blabbermouth. What diets have you found for best Can you <laughs> shut up, lady? Shut up! You know, I, I would just say, take her back. I don't want it. I don't want it to take her back. And he's got Caroline with him. Caroline's doing just fine. Let her, let him keep her yeah. as a nice little souvenir slash pet. He, she's useless, so just, just let her be. What are you doing, Skyla? I don't know anymore. Get ready? Now! Uh, uh, uh. Caroline! Yes! Really? Caroline! Mm. Forget about the Sky Swirl Stone. You can have the girl. Keep her. 
She's all yours, free of charge. Just promise you'll never let her come near me again. Okay, now that makes sense. Oh, nope, he's levitating again. Mm -hmm. Why do you find that funny? She's oh, obviously I'm not dairy for you. I don't know anymore. I, I would I would be scared out of my mind to be like, please, woman, get out of my life. Get out of my life. So, final thoughts. I remember that one when I was little. And it was kind of stupid. Bitch would not shut the fuck up for five seconds. My, my thoughts on it is... Shut up, Yandere! Shut up, Yandere! Shut up, Yandere! Shut up, Yandere! Oh. I honestly think if we're just going by number of lines, she should have been number one in the um, voice actor one. Yep. And 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 I think and 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 also what's bullshit is that Skylar can just go like, well, I need my son and they not here right now. I'm gonna teleport them here and shrink them at the same time. She's the queen of the wingdom, so she can do that. You know, I'm just going with... You're not giving these people a choice, and you're screwing them over. Yeah, and my thought is... The, I guess the second and third episode were better, because... That biatch was annoying! She just... Oh, she wouldn't shut up! <laughs> it's like, lady, there's a thing called show... Don't tell. You were just telling all the time. Oh, man. Just, ugh. It's so bad. Ugh. Let's see if the next episode will potentially be, be, less, painful. be, be less painful and maybe even be <gasps> an improvement. We will see you next time. So, I think you're giving it a little bit too much. Ah, uh, come on! That's what makes it fun! Eh. Alright, TTFN, y'all! Bye! Bye!